All right, so let's start here. Okay. So my camera girl, Sophia. So we can start right here. Wait, when, I didn't start it yet. Did I see it? It's already running, see? Is this okay? Made it to the shop to do some work. Finally get the Ross Performance uh, valve covers installed. Part, a small part of the dry sump system that I'll be using uh, for this time attack Lexus. So in the meantime, I got hurt. As you can see, I have a knee brace at the moment. I was doing some cool, cool dance moves, I guess. And, uh, myself so we'll just run down what we're gonna be using or putting on so these are the Ross performance valve covers hardware for the valve covers well not these this is more for the under oil pan pretty much this is for oil pan but this is for the valve covers then we're gonna be installing some jiffy tight parts Ross performance provided us with some nice gloves NGK spark plugs, spark plugs, gap tool, coin, gaskets, some hardware, the bracket to put the ignition project, um, coils, and some instructions. These are just the plugs for the Jiffy Tight stuff. So, have the family at the shop, so enjoy. All right, so this is where we start. You wanna put the cool Ross Performance gloves on, See, so they got some grippy stuff. Feel that, feel that grippy stuff. Feel that grippy stuff. You're gonna let go of this hand. Feel that grippy stuff. Feel that grip, so you don't drop stuff. What's that? It's a pillow for my knee. No, it's a knee brace. All right, camera girl, getting all fancy. All right, so let's put these on. No, you guys can talk. You guys can speak. No, I don't want to. Okay. You want to record? No, I want her to go like this. Say that again? He wants her to go like this. Oh, well, I mean, you can put it on my face until I start working over here. You can put it on my face. I mean, not that I look any cool or anything. But yeah, you don't have to focus on my face. Yeah, I don't know. That's what you're doing? His ear. Look at his ear. You guys. All right. All right, so. Let's get serious for a moment, right, Lolos? Right. All right, let's just do this quick. So these already have A and ports, so I can actually get these out. I can't remember what size these are. So this is a Diffy Tight Dash 10. Wow. So let's see if it's a Dash 10. Oh. It looks like it is a Dash 10. All right, so we'll run the Dash 10 plug in there. So there, so it just fits in there nicely, All right? So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna take it back out. Why? Because I need to put in the gasket first. <clears throat> so, so right under these, there are the gaskets, the gasket space. So I gotta put these on first. Like 
mad kids. <laughs> Moving the blocks. Pop. No. Death row and that thousand. Talking in Agnes. Yeah. Freedom and peach. Peach. And the anguish he speaks. Deep like Atlantis.
easy. This is the final product. It's not bolted up yet, but as you can see with the Ross Performance valve cover on, the laser, what do you call it? Lasering work or laser engraving, engraving, sorry. If I can speak properly. So laser engraving or engraving that they did to put our logo on. It's and their logo there as well. And the Ignition Project um, hexa coils. It just goes well with the Tomei um, cam gear. There's still more parts to add to the puzzle here. And yes, I have a Mega Racing tower brace or strut bar, whichever people want to call it. But there it is. That's another video.